Um, it's a sentence, syntactically speaking, it looks like, because you have basic idea twice, yeah? Uh, then you have... This is in... Ah. Play it one more time, can you? Conceptually, something here which puzzles me, yeah, which is if an evaded cadence, right, is the failure to accomplish the objective of the of the piece. But in this example, the highest note somehow is in the trip of the evaded cadence. So, syn deep, syntactically deep into the meaning yeah, of each resource, it's slightly contradictory, which can be aesthetically interesting, yeah? The natural, the natural behavior should have been maybe something like... phrase yeah beyond the evaded cadences and everything yeah but now you added the evaded cadence so and it's here right yeah I like it I like it it's it's con it's contradictory, but I I I think it makes sense. L let me listen to it one more time. Deceptive. Yeah. No. Which one do you want, Iris? It doesn't matter. Like any, any, any. Epic. <laughs> time technique in the receptive case yes okay. I went with that okay yeah the one more time technique can be used in any cadence yeah it's more normally used in the evaded cadence but in this one can be used as well um, 
a very coherent use of the accompaniment patterning yeah so it's it's a uh, it's it's all right yeah i like for example we did in bar number four yeah in which you did do and then you climbed up yeah with mi fa sol fa yeah so you presented the fa properly then you went down in sepoid motion fa mi re do mm, which is good then you didn't accidentally just went to something else on the following bar you went to re yeah which is good stepwise then c and then you went to do to complete so you didn't have a gap there so do strong beat and do again and then you have a jump uh, which is fine because it is needed so um, yeah it's it's correct let me listen to it once again because there's something in the melodic line that backs me up so <laughs> deception yeah, disappointment yeah in your deceptive cadence when in the last bar eh, of the first line you do b a b yeah so you stop the sequences of thirds in which you did always f e g g f a a g b and everyone expects b a c but it doesn't happen there yeah and it goes to B, which is disappointing as well syntactically. Yeah? Uh -huh. Exactly. And and then you deliver it. You deliver the, the, the expected note in the precise perfect place, yeah, which is at the end. We finally reach C. If I compare these two examples, this one is more scholastic. Yeah, this one is more um, to the uh, attain to the book, yeah. It's very effective. It's very clear. Yeah, very Beethovenian in a way. Yeah, the other one a bit more Mozartian, a bit more naughty. Yeah, but still, yeah, it's still nice. Both of them are very good examples. Very good work. Very good. Thank you. <coughs> good. Excellent. Um, Georgios, we can see your um, ABA, the one that you showed me. This. Yes, with ex yeah, just play it once, explain it then, and then we we'll repeat. Okay. <laughs> The antecedent and the consequent. The consequent has an extension by. Let me think. I have for the moment. Wait. Exactly. My cadence is. Six, seven, one. Do, re, mi, uh, C, D, E. And I go C, D, C. And then the real, authentic, and the actual cadence. Uh, then the B is, I think, as well. Uh, no, it's a mm, sentence which has two, 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 one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now, 
It has also an extension by means of, let me think about it. It, this is the cadence of it. It is, but the sound of the cadence is a bit deceptive. Yes. That's its cadence. I on, on purpose didn't think it's on do. It's, it's on do. The first one is on me, in, on E, the second one is on C. The, they both have six, seven, one cadence. This one has A, which does it. But the actual cadence itself is a bit deceptive, which allows me to then move to the cadence of the me, of the E, or the first one, to return to the A. Make sense? Yes. Okay. And then the A again, with an extra voice. And again, the deceptive cadence. And after the deceptive cadence, an evaded cadence. Here, on first first inversion. Let me put the... Yeah. Next. Okay. I will criticize the ending only. Okay? The ending of such a melodious piece, yeah? I don't, I don't think it's as effective as it should, yeah, the ending. The ending could, because it's an ABA with certain, with certain elan, no, with certain, uh, how to say, uh, with certain pretension in the good way, no, it, it just creates an ambience very effectively, and that ambience would, I believe it would benefit from we can work then on that on Wednesday but uh, it could benefit from a bit more liquidation in all sense of the texture of the register of the accompaniment of everything it could be slightly longer yeah slightly longer more exploration of the of the timbre yeah so we can disintegrate the, the, the break down yeah the, the the sound of the piano a bit more and and, and give it more tail yeah, that's the word. So it, I think it's a piece that it okay. constantly uh, it constantly calls the concept of the tail. Yeah, because of the accompaniment pattern that you use, that is so so extend it so extends. No, it has a tri a triplet. It's, it has short notes. Taka ta taka 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 ta taka taka taka. So that gesture needs to be finished. Yeah, in the end. Yeah, Other, it's not. Is more sophisticated than the piece itself is more sophisticated than the current ending. Yeah, so we, we could experience experiment with something else. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, the resources are very well used. Yes, I have nothing to say about that. Uh, um, another thing I want to highlight is the uh, the clever decision of actually changing the accompaniment pattern in B. Yeah, that refreshes a lot the the piece it balances uh, up yeah the 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 interest in the piece and even when then we come back to almost the the same register yeah we come back to it with renewed energies with new timbre on the right hand uh, with double stops yeah and the double stops are not just random yeah they are more open positions heading into closer positions heading back into open position so everything is taken care of uh, with precision yeah and that's why the piece sounds pleasant yeah there is nothing there uh, left to randomness yeah so the, the, it, it, for example if we take into consideration 25 a bar 29 no yeah 29 where we can see uh, that at the first sight we can see e and then f no and then there is only two stops, uh, beginning of the bar, and then in, in beat number two, we see another two stops, yeah? Those two stops, particularly in the treble, yeah? Uh, they are spaced by stepwise motion. And then in the in the bass, they are prepared, yeah, with stepwise motion as well, from uh, A to E, yeah? 
so that the craftsmanship there is is good yeah it's very 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 good and then when we see the octaves uh, the octaves are well presented as well because uh, Georgios didn't use the octaves just uh, unpolitely in the beginning of the first time exploration he, he used something rounder like the like the six yeah the, the GE and then he went on the first octave yeah open sound then he closed up again and then he deployed the octave finally yeah so it's, it's prepared sound wise everything in music needs to be prepared it sounds better yeah a dissonance is, is better when it sounds prepared anything that changes the timbre is better if you prepare it and that's a sound wise sound wise is prepared yeah so it's, it happens just once before or twice and then it happens systematically so this is a very good example actually yeah very 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 good example the only thing i I yes, I will criticize with certain level of confidence. Yeah, is the ending. I think the ending doesn't honor the the rest of the of the piece. We will improve it. Yeah, in, in ways. Yeah, maybe you still like it like that after the improvement, <laughs> but uh, I will try <laughs> yeah, to improve it on Wednesday. Um, it's a very good example. Something else? Oh, small examples of evaded. Yeah, let's do some examples of evaded cadence. Uh, one thing, one, one bracket. Uh, Laura, I was thinking about, uh, I will call you after the lesson. Yeah, so we start with our own lessons. So, yeah, stay there. And um, for you, as you're not a composer and you might not be inclined to compose, yeah, if you want, yeah, for analysis and for the practical, if you could find examples. Okay. Yes. And I will lead you to Hayden. If you go to, because I can help you there quite easily, just download yeah from the IMSLP all the Hayden sonatas and you will find examples for everything. Yeah, okay. it will be very good for you for sight reading, particularly the first volume. Uh, the the pieces are beautiful and they are easy to read, yeah, and it will help your own uh, your own skill in the piano. And you will find plenty of examples. And I think you will feel more comfortable like that than by creating them. Yours. If you want to produce an example, you're more than welcome. Eh? But if, I think maybe you find more, if you find more yourself more no, in a, in a comfortable zone there with examples. Okay? So, Giorgios, we continue. Yes, you find it. <laughs> some practical now with you live practical yeah so yeah you can just uh, take off the sharing screen Gerdos, and we start with some live practical yeah and we finish the lesson like that so Anna Anna so yes, yes, okay good so first of all eight bar sentence can you C major Oh, but I have to go to the piano. Don't worry, sing it. Okay. It was sentence C major. Uh... I give you the keynote. Just one second. Sorry, I don't... Okay. Yeah. Do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, si, do, si, la, sol, fa, mi, re, do, do, mi, sol, do, sol, mi, do. Yeah? And you can start on on do, do yeah. So keynote, like in the aviary is a mix up. Keynote do, do. Sing it after. Do. Very good. Do. do re mi fa sol la si do okay. si okay. la sol fa mi re do. Let's see. Ta ta da ta ta da pa pa pa. There goes four bars. 
Do, na, 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 mi, do, mi, do, sol. Tempo. Pa. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Mm. So, let's organize ourselves. So we do. One basic idea, two bars. Deliver that. Only that. Let's see. Ta, con, cantando. Ta, ta, ra, pa, pa, ra, pa, pa, pa. Well done. Good. And then... Repetition, statement response, or in the same key. Okay. Ta pa ra pa pa ra pa 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 ra pa ra pa. Okay. So if we have basic idea, Antonic prolongation. Kind of. Let me help you. I will. I will. I will force your first basic idea so it goes on majors. In Do major, in, in C major. Let me just put it in four bar, in four by four. So, tom, pim, pam, pi, ra, ra. No. Pam, pim, pam, ta, ta, tam, pi, pi, pam, 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 pam. Yeah, that's nice. That's always a good idea. Pam bibi pam piri pam 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 bibi pam piri ram pam 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 yeah tonic prolongational yeah so pam bibi pam piri pam 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 yeah so do mi do mi do sol pa mi re do re si yeah for basic idea and then we can choose we can do for example uh, identical repetition so right or we can do statement response so it's identical because I kept it in the in the tonic so then now or let's see if you can if you can do the continuation can you so let me give you the the basic idea again so and then what do you want a continuation or something that i invent no a continuation for that for what you did so continuation okay. Do a bit of fragmentation, no? And then cadencia. Vale, pues... On your th on your motif. Mm -hmm. My harmony is more than kindergarten. I can't make it more simple. Yeah, it's just <laughs> always the same chords. Yeah. So, um, but syntactically, we could deploy a sentence. No, clear for everyone. Mm -hmm. So, Iris, I will play it all for you, okay? And I want you to explain it, yeah? In the sense of explaining why it's a sentence, okay? So. Uh, so, it's a sentence because we have the syntax of the sentence. So basic idea, repetition of the basic idea, and then continuation as the, with the cadential uh, progression. Why wasn't it 
an extended cadential progression. It's clearly not, Before, why not? I mean, we don't have any extension. We have the, the eight bars long, and we don't have any... Um, Georgios? Um, Obviously, the cadence um, begin on the fifth bar, which would have been the extended four bars, five, six, seven, eight. Exactly, but having the dominant and tonic, and dominant and tonic again stops it. Yeah, so that, that's why we don't have any. We would have, I will do, I, I will now make an extended cadence operation so you can see the difference. So let me just. Uh, And I, yes, but I, I will I will do something even clearer. Yeah, that's an extended cadential progression. Yeah, what's the difference, Iris? Um, you add some material to the in between the. No, there's a harmonic reason, Georgios. The cadence starts on the fifth bar, tonic, subdominant, dominant, tonic. Exactly. Yeah, school, school cadence, tonic, subdominant, dominant, tonic. The school perfect authentic cadence, nothing too pretentious there. Yeah, and it happens strong beat of everybody. Ping, pong, pong, boom. Yeah, in, in four bars. Yeah, that's why it's an extended tension progression. Yeah. As opposed to what happened before, we have uh, I don't remember precisely what we have, but I think we have first, fifth, first, no, first, fifth, and we have fifth thirds, or something like that. I don't remember what I did before. But yeah, we had an interjection of tonic and dominant. Incomplete. An incomplete one. Exactly. So, okay, okay, I will play it for you again in this form, okay, and Iris will do an evaded cadence and Georgios will do a deceptive cadence, okay, for you, so... again because I didn't do it very well. So. Okay. Can you play it, Iris? So it sets in your, in your head as well. Yes, uh, exactly what you just did. Yeah, as much as you can. I mean, we are doing it live, so it might change a bit. <laughs> okay, I'm going to play one of the lower, is that fine? So yeah, if I... you feel more comfortable, so you don't feel nervous, just do the right hand first, okay? No, well, it's fine, different. I think I can do both. Okay, so it's fine. Uh... I will change something. Pam, pee, pa, pam, pam. Let me change something. No, I don't like something that I did. I will change something and I will tell you why. I would like this the bar number six to express subdominant better yeah because i expressed kind of dominant with a contradiction on the on the bass so we are going to change that bit so Listen to 
this is much better. Bum, ba, ba, bum, bum. The continuation. So tonic. And then, okay, so, and then let me help you with the last two bars. So if you count it, do re mi fa mi fa mi re do re mi fa mi fa mi re do re mi fa mi fa re do. Do, re, mi, fa, mi, fa, re, do, si, do, de las tubas. Ok. Sorry. Sí. Exactly. And the, the last bar, the first to the last bar will be tonic in second inversion. And the last bar will be the dominant. And the, the, yes. Yeah, we'll make it okay. long, but... I like it more. Let's see. Mm -hmm. I made it nine bars actually, so we could do it eight bars if we do it like this. No, that's okay. easier. So okay. mm -hmm. the last bar will be yes, do it, do it, do it, do it yourself. Super. Okay. So, can you play it all from beginning to the end? Yes. Um... concept is correct. My advice yeah, is to use the material that we haven't used in the fragmentation. Yeah? So the fragmentation is all about no? Because we did Remember, if you have an evaded cadence, you should use the tail that we already have for the perfect authentic cadence. So So what's the material that we didn't use? Tam pa pa pam pa pa pam 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 pam. No so. So I will do the end now myself. something more sophisticated like sorry 
Yeah, for example. Um, do it again and finish it. So do a debated case and come back and deliver the full example. Okay. So, um, from the beginning. Yes. a bit better. That was a bit better. Yeah, good, good. Georgios, deceptive cadence. Anna, I will give you a bit of handicap. So, Anna, prepare an evaded cadence with the same thing. Um, Different two ibises. Okay? Prepare it while Georgios does this one. And so you have time to think. How pretentious should it be? Let me see. Let me remember the basic idea. For the leading note, a little bit, but okay. Six from the minor. I have to go for a lesson, Mr. Juan. Okay, go, go, go. That's fine. That's fine. We are we are heading to the end. Okay, see you, Georgios. And 